So I'm going to show you how to use a calculator for this question. There, we just did it yeah. manually. So you got the two vectors. It wants to find the vector product of those two vectors. So open up your calculator, add calculator, or open up a new document. You can go menu, this is the long way, you can go menu, matrices, vector, vector, cross product. Or you can just memorize the shortcut, and he guesses what the shortcut is. That's the number bar. Like there it is, cross P. Bracket. Three. It doesn't have to be capital. No. Cross P, and then we type it in. Two, so that's the I. Negative one is the J, and three is the K. That's the first vector with square brackets. Second vector, square brackets again, three, four, negative one. I, J, and K. And don't forget the little comma in between. And then you press enter, and there's the cross product. Same as the answer before, negative 11I, 11J, 11K. See how much quicker that is on an exam, tech active. The second part of the question, it asked us to convert it to a unit vector. So any guesses what the shortcut for unit vector is? Unit V. Ta-da! Unit V. Bracket. And you guys know how to do this. Scroll back up, press enter. You don't want to do it again. So you press this little arrow here and see how it selected the vector. And then you press enter and it's put it into there. Press enter again and it turns it into the unit vector. Write it down, full marks. Just don't forget to write the n hat equals and then all of those components with i, j, and k after them. So there you go, cross product unit vector on your calc.